Hey everyone, it's Christina from the DIYMummy.com and today I want to give you some small bathroom organization ideas plus I want to give you a little mini tour of our powder room. Welcome back to my channel again today everybody. Happy 2017 to you all again today. Today I'm so excited to be hosting an organization DIY and home decor challenge. So make sure to pop down to the description box below and click on that playlist to see all of the videos that my vlogging and videoing friends have put together for you. And I'm hoping that this series and this playlist will just be a really awesome source of inspiration for you as you purge and clean and organize this January. Today I wanted to give you a little mini tour of our main floor powder room. I've done this tour on my blog, I'll link to it below, but I haven't ever done it here on YouTube, so I thought I'd give you a little look at it. We did a little bit of a renovation to it last spring, and I think it looks super cute and fun if you like butterflies and birds and um, interesting wallpaper, paper, you might like our powder room. And then I wanted to show you some of the small and simple things that I've done to organize the space. It is our, our guest bathroom, but I do do my makeup and hair down here because I have small kids and I kind of want to be on the main floor um, when they're playing as I do my makeup and hair. I'm sure that'll change as they grow, but for now I do need to store lots of my beauty supplies here as well. Um, none of these ideas are incredibly life-changing, but they're all very um, practical and cost-effective. So I'm hoping that by sharing some of these bathroom organization ideas with you today that you will get some inspiration for your own organization. Also, please make sure to stick around to the end of this video because I have an important question I want to ask you guys. So please stick around and then answer the question in the description box below. Thank you so much and let's get started. Our main floor powder room is right between our sitting room and our kitchen and our back entry. And it's really small. It's only about five feet wide by five feet deep. But I've tried to pack it with lots of personality just because it's such a small space. We have a very tall ceiling in here. So I wanted something just really interesting on the walls. So last spring we, I rather, installed this bird wallpaper. I found it on, on Amazon and I will leave a link to it in the description box below if you're interested. It was not pre-pasted so it was kind of a pain to install but I think it was totally worth, worth it. And the vanity is just from Home Depot um, a few years ago. It's just a faux marble top and then we did some DIY board and batten trim on the bottom just to kind of break up that link that we have in this really tall room. So I think it's just kind of a really cool conversation piece. Whether you like the bird wallpaper or not, it's just something interesting that you see when you walk in here. So here's my first organizational trick here. I installed these shelves. They're just Ikea brackets, Ikea shelves, very inexpensive. And then I have some sizable baskets that have just some of our random beauty supplies. Um, the girls face paint and glitter and also just, um, just some random beauty supplies there. So definitely baskets and shelves. Uh, vertical storage I think is really important in small spaces. Here is the vanity. It is a closed vanity. I'd recommend a closed vanity with storage when you have a small space like this. And storage on the door. So I have just this simple wire basket I found at HomeSense for um, some of my styling tools. And then I found this really cool, um, this really cool stacked kind of caddy here, also from HomeSense, which is just like home goods in the States. I love the little gold on it. And the wood, I have some hair products in there. We store our toilet paper down here. And then I just have these Ikea caddies. They're just plastic. You can kind of stack them. And I have some more um, personal supplies in there as well. Those ones aren't used quite as much. And then down here in this bottom drawer, I have all of our hand towels that I folded. So those are really easy to grab when you need to have them um, for your guests as well. So that is how underneath our vanity looks. Just really simple, but just this stuff is just really easy to grab when it is on the door and then just in caddies and bins inside. And that is our simple small powder room with just as much storage as I can pack into it as possible in that five foot by five foot space. Again, go vertical when you're short on storage and use lots of baskets and lots of little bins. 
Thank you so much for watching my video today. I hope you found some inspiration for your own organization goals this year, 2017. If you have any questions or comments on our powder room bathroom, please leave them in the description box below. And I just wanted to ask you guys another question. I've been really enjoying YouTube uh, last year and this year I thought maybe I should kind of pick it up a little bit. Um, I do love my blog still, but YouTube, I just really love this community. So I thought I, thought I should step up my game a little bit. And I'm considering adding kind of more of like a show to my channel, um, either on Monday or on Thursday. And my two ideas were to do on Monday, do a Mommy Monday, so just kind of give you sneak peeks into my everyday life with my kids and just kind of do like some mom style rants and mom hacks and things like that. So that's idea number one. The second idea I had was doing a Thrifty Thursday video. So these videos would be um, just tips and tricks on how to save money if you are on a budget, uh, just some family friendly ideas, uh, so maybe some uh, budget friendly hacks, DIYs, um, things like that. So could you please let me know which one you think would be more exciting to watch for you or more interesting, the Mummy Mondays, so more mom focused content, or the Thrifty Thursdays, so money saving budget friendly tips. Please let me know in the description box below, I so appreciate your input. Thanks again for watching and please make sure to click on that playlist below to see the rest of the organization videos and I will see you all again next time. Bye!